Eh, okay, that's what. Oh, wait, they feel cool, though. <laughs> Is it cool? Welcome back, YouTube. I'm Super Dan the Shoe Man, and I've got a special unboxing for you today. This is my my biggest hit of the year on sneakers, and my only SB that I've ever gotten from sneakers. But first, two little housekeeping things. Um, number one, this is Ephesians two eight through nine. God saved you by grace when you were when you believed, and you can't take credit for this. It's a gift from God. Salvation is not a reward for the good things we've done, so none of us can boast for it. And salvation is such an important thing when we understand it as something that we don't, uh, that we receive as a gift and that we don't do anything for. And there's nothing that we can do for it. If we think that we have to act a certain way, do certain things in order to receive salvation from God, every time we, we mess up, we condemn ourselves. Um, when we know that we mess up and we just live under his grace, life just completely changes and we have a heart transformation. And those things that that we think we should be doing for God, those, those things that we think we shouldn't be doing for God, those things come much more naturally uh, when, when we have that transformation. And when we do mess up, we don't have to live in, oh, what's the word? Shame, not shame, guilt. We don't have to live with the guilt of it. We don't have to condemn ourselves because we always just look back to the cross. So it was an important word. I wanted to share with y'all one more little thing. One more thing. Social. I want to say a big thank you to just in the last few days, Caleb Lycon, Superboy 2K6, I like this name, Big Time Timmy Jim, Rodney P, and Stomare, some public subscribers. Uh, thanks for subbing. Uh, tell your friends, tell your grandma, I'm glad you're here. And now let's get to it. Here's the Nike SB Dunk Strawberry Cough. This is the Nike SB Dunk High Pro QS University Red Spinach Green. Yeah, that's it. Uh, that's it. Going on into another language. Uh, University Red and Spinach Green. That sounds terrible. This is a size 11. I got this on exclusive access. Uh, my only exclusive access of the year. Uh, it wasn't my personal account, but it was one of my friends. And we got it. Here it is. Now, before I take this out of the box, you've seen it on the B-roll. But before I take it out of the box, Strawberry Cough has a story behind it. A lot of shoes have stories behind them. This shoe has a story behind it. Uh, the Chocolate Milk has a story behind it. The Off-White 2s have a new story that I didn't know about, uh, or a story that I didn't know about. And I like a lot of those stories. They, they're they nostalgic and important. We learn stuff from them. Not so much with this one. I'm not gonna keep this shoe. I'm not putting this shoe. I might put it on my foot, but I'm not gonna wear it. Um, if you really wanna know what this, is about you can find it somewhere else it's just I, I can't believe nike actually did this and supposedly that was why this has been delayed so many times it's supposedly released on october the 22nd never saw it on sneakers but i did get the exclusive access uh, you've seen the reactions from a couple people in uh the b-roll at the beginning and this is my first view at it i didn't even want to see the box at first because i wasn't sure if it came in a special box but this is just a normal um sb dunk box so here it is i haven't seen it yet we got the wood grain paper and Ooh, I, don't like I like this more than I thought I would actually. I'm definitely not keeping it. Right? <laughs> I am definitely not keeping it. But I do like this shoe. Alright. We got some really hairy suede on the back. I do like that. There's our coughing uh, strawberry. And obviously, as you can see, the whole thing is supposed to look like a strawberry. Um, you get the little, I guess these are called, these are like the seed pods where they're at, where the seeds are at in the strawberry. This leather, it's like, meh, it's not that good a leather. leather. This leather feels pretty good. 
Uh, you see we got a rolled edge, so that's kind of like a Jordan 1 mid, Jordan 1 low type leather quality, which again is just meh. Uh, but this is awesome, and this leather is okay. We get the round SB laces. We get two more laces. You get like a, what is that, peachy color? Yeah, it's close to the same color as the toe. As the toe, yeah. And the green, that's much darker than this. I guess it's about the same color as this. This is some velvet. Feels pretty nice. You get a little stem happening back here. Oh, that's my favorite part of the whole show. It is. I think I like that. The, uh, maybe not the most, but I do like that. Um, I wouldn't pull on that too hard. Get some... Uh, Nice stitch in here across the heel. We get an icy outsole that we can see, like, I guess that's just plastic uh, or more more sole in there. Can you get a close-up of that? That looks really cool. I like this icy outsole. Because you can see through it. And you can yeah, I like the, the really yeah. thick, look, look at how thick that swoosh is. I like the really thick cut swoosh. Hey, you got this plastic coming through here. Man, this is, I do like the bottom. This is nice. I feel like if they didn't have a story behind them, you should keep them. Because yeah, I can, maybe. like, if if someone who has really great style, or even any, okay, maybe not even great style. Just if I, if I saw those on somebody's feet, I would think they were so cool. I, I know, yeah. That's why I'd wear them. Because they just look so cool. Like, some shoes, like, those and Shadow 2.0s, like, they're not. They're, just, they're nice, but they're just black. Yeah, I like them, but yeah. they're just whatever. Yeah, like, these Because these, are so like, cool. you wear those, but, like, these you rock. I'm amazed you rock. But, like, you just, that, those you rock. But when you look at these, you don't even have to know what this is. Like, this, you rock that, and it doesn't matter if anybody knows what it is. It's blanging, right? Blang. Blang, blang. But, and this is kind of the same way. It's like, what does that guy have on his feet? And if he can rock that, he must be pretty cool. I feel like I've never seen a high before. Oh, yeah, I have, but this just, oh. <laughs> I don't know. This just look very high. Uh, here's another coughing strawberry. That's so cute. Yeah, no, it's not. I think if he wasn't cool. coughing with bloodshot eyes, maybe. But okay, minus the bloodshot eyes. You get the. So cute. Uh, this is the SB, uh, the SB Dunk uh, insole, Zoom Air, extra like PU uh, padding here. This is a very thick insole too. The what is this stuff called? I don't know what it's called. Um, the <laughs> the what's this thing called? Tongue. The tongue is not that thick. It's not as thick as a normal SB tongue, as, as a lot of SB tongues. Um, I've never had or seen, I, I didn't watch any reviews on this, and I, I kind of want to watch reviews before I get a shoe like this, and then I kind of don't. Um, I kind of want to watch reviews because I see, I hear things about the shoe that I wouldn't necessarily see, but a lot of times with these really nice uh, exclusive type things, type things, I want to get my first impression here on the on my video rather than having watched a whole bunch of detailed stuff on YouTube. The SB Pro, lo, the low SB Dunk Pros have extra padding in the back, um, like little pillows in the inside. This doesn't have that back that away, but this is very padded, very thick, you see? Yes, I see. Um, these have double lace wings. Woo! Yeah, neither of them, oh, this is, yeah. I like that part. Yeah. I like that part a lot. Yeah. Yeah, this is cool. God, it's just so terrible that they had to put such a bad, like, <laughs> dumb story behind this. Like, they could have just made this strawberry, and it would have been almost just as cool. Um, here's another little detail. Travis Scott, most Travis Scotts have some kind of little pouch in them. Here's a pouch. Oh, that's cool. The bottom side of the tongue. No, it's not. Um. I didn't know that's what that was for. Uh, same thing on this. It looks like it's, it's the exact same insole, so I'm not going to take this one out. Um, it's the same as this. A lot of times SBs have uh, two different uh, different graphics on the insole, but this is the same. So uh, let me do another comparison really quick. All right, this one doesn't really sit flat either, but stitching through here does get a little bit closer together right there, but it's not terrible. Yeah, a little bit closer together on this side, too. So if you compare the distance here and here. But this, like, on foot, I probably wouldn't even be able to see. Um, we don't have to worry. So this is kind of a two, two-fold two piece. We don't have to worry about the paint on this midsole like we, uh, midsole and outsole like we do um, with, or like we have with other shoes. 
but you also can't see the nice uh, changes in um, in the line, which I like seeing. I like this about Dunks as opposed to Jordans that don't have it. Um, you can't see it on this because it's not painted. It's not two different colors. Uh, let's see if there's anything else I can tell you about this shoe. No, and I really like that. I really like the outsole. Like a Dior Jordan or the Wolf Gray Jordan Ones, Jordan One Lows. Um, I'm, I'm not a fan of this texture. I think I would have preferred it if it was all suede, or maybe, uh, maybe more velvet. I like the velvet. But with this leather here, that's good. I think the textures really look good on there. I guess it looks okay. I just don't like the leather. Right. I don't have. They any. like use the perfect material for the part of the shoe that I, that's what I think. The perfect material for a strawberry. And then that part. Is oh yeah, like this is perfect. perfect. Oh, yeah, and I love then the this. The velvet in the back. It's, yeah. It all goes together well. I love this. I, I just don't like the material. I think they could have done just as well with some better material. It is pretty thick cut though. Look at the lace stay there. How thick that is. I don't know what the lace stay is. This piece. Oh. Where the lace laces go through. Mm -hmm. It's just reinforcement for the laces. I used to do that when I was a kid a lot. I, I, I tied my shoes really tight and I would always rip through the lace holes up here because I tied them so tight. Yeah, I had a problem with that kind of stuff when I was little. Also, <laughs> tighten my belt as, as tight as I could. Oh, I used to do that too. So, all right. I was going to say this at the beginning of the video. I always put this at the end instead of at the beginning. I thought about it earlier. I just forgot. 100 likes in two days for this shoe. This this is a... Uh, this, this shoe with tax in the state of Georgia was $116, $117. Resells for over $500, almost $600. 100 likes, 48 hours after this video goes live. I'm recording this video on Wednesday. It's going to go live Thursday at 4 so Saturday by 400 likes. I don't even think any of my videos have 100 likes. So this shoe though, I'll do a giveaway video for this shoe. 100 likes in 48 hours. That's your like goal. Like it up. Tell your grandma. Comment down below what you think about this. If y'all want to get into some conversation about the, uh, the strawberry cough, you go right ahead. It just seems kind of ridiculous that Nike would... Uh, would make a shoe themed with this. I guess uh, the SBs, the SB Dunks are kind of a, a more open canvas. Jordan, I don't think would ever do this. But the SBs, when they do, I don't even think this is a collab though. I don't know. Um, but the SBs, when when they work on special SBs, uh, it's kind of a blank canvas. They can do kind of crazy stuff with them. And this one is pretty crazy. So. We will not be wearing these. I'm probably going to sell. I'm going to try to sell these. I'm going to try to sell them on Facebook Marketplace before I uh, before I put these on StockX. I might even try eBay because I haven't I haven't sold anything on eBay before. Can you see that? Those are butt cheeks. This the little <laughs> marks here. Yeah. Well, not anymore. Oh, okay. It's gone. It yeah. was just from. What are you doing? What do you mean? What am I doing? You're going back there. Oh, I wasn't meaning to. I was looking at the shoe. Oh. <laughs> you told me to. Um, but this is going to go to fund some some other shoes. Uh, we got several coming up that we really want to get. And I need to make some more videos for y'all. One more thing about videos coming up. I've got several videos shoes that I of shoes that I got late after they released. And I recorded the video shortly after I got them. They might have been recorded shortly after the shoe released but i have i've been putting up videos like these for the fire that had just come out um and just saving those videos so what are you doing trying to pull my back oh. my records um so some of these videos coming up might be of fairly old releases but give those videos a like it doesn't cost you anything doesn't really take you any time to give those videos a like helps out this channel a lot and uh Keeps it going, gets y'all more shoes to watch reviews of, hopefully more uh, limited, exclusive, uh, dope looking shoes, <laughs> get it, uh, <laughs> shoes like these. Um, and Hesper kicked me out of the dining room. I've been doing all the recording in the dining room. I realized that uh, my, my neighbor actually gave me some, some 
what, like studio lights. <laughs> and he gave me the box. I thought he just gave me the box. And then he gave me one of the studio lights put together on a tripod. But it had another light in it. And I just figured Ooh. that, yeah, I just figured that out after Hesper moved all my stuff into the... This has been my uh, my multi-purpose room. So we've got my, my shoes in the background, my fishing <laughs> stuff over here, some more fishing stuff over there. Um, so let me know what you think about the new recording studio with the shoe wall in the background plus some fishing poles plus yeah, a bunch of fishing poles <laughs> um if, y'all are, if any of y'all are fishermen that's mostly shimano and g loomis in case you really cared in case you in case you really cared <laughs> i'm sure somebody that watches these video these videos fishes me you? oh i thought you were gonna say cares i've said it before i yeah, fishes and cares. I just got back from... <laughs> uh, when did I get back from? Fishing tournament. Yes. Georgia State Classic. Uh, Bass Nation Classic. Lake. Clarks Hill. Didn't do too well. Didn't do terrible. But didn't make it to the next... I didn't make it to, to regionals. But this is the Nike SB Dunk Low. No, no. High. Pro. Strawberry Cough. Smash that like button. <laughs> You're so pretty. I'm so glad. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs>